Siku moja baada ya Rais William Ruto kutangaza kuwa atachunguza kwa makini ripoti ya kamati ya uiano na kuitekeleza kwa utaratibu, wataalamu wa katiba wanaelekeza kuwa baadhi ya mapendekezo yatabadilisha masuala ya utawala na hivyo taifa litahitaji kuandaa kura ya maamuzi. Mawakili wa zoefu wa masuala ya kikatiba Abdi Kadir Mohamed na Bob Mkangi wanasema mazungumzo hayo hata hivyo hayakushughulikia vilivyo gharama ya maisha. Baada ya ripoti ya kamati ya uiano kuwasilishwa kwa Rais William Ruto na kinara wa azimio Raila Odinga, wataalamu wamepiga darubini yaliyomo lakini wamekashifu kamati hiyo kwa kutozingatia maswala muhimu ya kitaifa. I thought that the politicians as has been before they were going to use the voice of the people to create an excuse to sit and talk and then when they talk they talk about their own things but they leave one inch and that is what we are seeing right now and what these good gentlemen and ladies are proposing are uh, really they, they are answering questions that are not been asked uh, they, they they are setting their own exam they are interested in providing offices Uh, and, and funds for the political class that's not what kenyans are asking for baadhi ya mapendekezo yaliyotolewa ni kuepo kwa wadhifa wa kiongozi wa upinzani pamoja na manaibu wake wawili kuidhinisha wadhifa wa mkuu wa mawaziri kwenye katiba kuipa bunge la seneti fedha za kusimamia utendakazi katika kaunti hazina ya uwakilishi wadi na hazina ya maeneo bunge Mkangi na Abdi Kadir ambao walihusika katika kutengeneza katiba ya sasa wanahisikuwa maswala haya yatabadilisha jinsi utawala ulivyo kwa sasa if the proposals are going to be engineered and processed uh, into furtherance the ultimate decider must be the Kenyan uh, citizen the Kenyan voter who must make the decision at the ballot box it's not workable unless you change the infrastructure the architectural uh, the architecture of our constitution having a prime minister and uh, the office of the leader of opposition makes no sense and they are going to create instability which is not what we are asking for right now we have a stable constitution we have an economic crisis let us deal with the economic crisis hata hivyo ripoti ya kamati hiyo imepata pingamizi kutoka kwa muungano wa Azimio 1K 